For our automated offline raffle machine, we will use the application called the hat. This application will help us pick names of learners randomly, especially when we have our recitation graded or not. So let us try this one. Let's open the app. Here you can see icons such as draw names from hat, coin flip, save or load list, Add names to list, edit selected names, print list, program preferences, help, and share. So let us add names. Let us click this icon. Let us try add individual names. Okay, let's type John Ishmael. M. Blasco. Then, add. You can now see the name here. Another one. Stephen Von Atrehenio. And then, add. If we are done, let us just click done. We can also copy names from our Excel file. So let us try. Let's go to our Excel file. Now let us copy these names, names of learners. Copy and then go back to the app and then paste names from clipboard. Append to existing list. Here they are. We can see names of learners here. We can now proceed to the raffle. Let us click the icon hat. Here we can see the hat where we can draw names from. Let's try. Let's draw me. Okay, so Garcia Marcella A. So we can also add uh, toggle music to make it more exciting. So let's draw me. So, change the number of names to draw at a time. So, for example, we want to have groupings, triad, dyad, or group of five. We can change the number, number here. We will type, for example, three for our triad. So, we can now draw names. already here in our selected names. For example, we want group of five, especially in our groupings. Each group will have five members, so we want to select five names randomly. We can use this one. So, for example, group of five, let's type number five and then draw names. We will add some music. Okay, so this is how the hat applications work. And then we can now print or print the result 
or save the result to text file. We can also copy result to clipboard. So it's up to us what we want to do. So now let us proceed to our next uh, application, the uh, offline quizzing using the application uh, Word Wondershare Creator. Wondershare Quiz Creator helps us create quizzes with multimedia file. Okay, so let's open the app. Since we don't have yet the license, we will use the free trial version. So let's click free trial and then create a new quiz. So here, we can see uh, different types of quizzes like true or false, multiple choice, multiple response, fill in the blank, matching, sequence, word bank, click map, short essay, and blank page. Sa taas naman, quiz properties, player template, preview, publish, and manage result. So start tayo sa true or false. Right click, new question. Yan. So, lalabas na siya dyan. Lakihan natin. Uh, para din siya, ang function niya ay para din Microsoft Word. Nandyan din yung font, font size. So, lakihan natin yung font size. Gawin natin 26 para mas visible. So, mag-type na tayo ng question natin. Earth. And Earth is the only livable planet in the solar system. So, pag gusto nating mag-add ng picture or image, i-click lang natin tong portion na to. Click natin, add image. So, i-direct niya na tayo dun sa ating folder. Yan. So, meron na tayong image. Ngayon naman, gusto nating mag-add ng sound. Click lang natin yung sound. And then, dito may makikita tayong tatlong icons. Dito naman, itong una, import an audio file. Click natin yan kung meron tayong prepared na audio. Dito naman, kapag gusto nating mag-record ng audio narration. At itong last, itong text-to-speech. So, this time, ito ang gagamitin natin. Click natin yan. So, meron na siyang audio. Ngayon, dito naman, oops, ayan na. Ito, lakihan natin tong sagot natin. Para mas kita, ATN, ganun din to. Yan. Dito sa set feedback and points, itong correct, palitan natin siya. So, dito tayo sa uh, right side, itong more. Click natin yung more. Tapos, delete na natin to. Lagyan natin ng uh, image. O, oh, yan. Ito, piliin natin tong emoji na to. Yan. Tapos, pwede rin tayong maglagay ng audio. Click natin. Since wala naman tayong prepared na audio, magre-record tayo ngayon ng audio. Try natin ha. Click natin tong red. Great job! Yan. So, meron na tayo, Beth. Pakinggan natin. Great job! O, okay na natin. And then, okay. So, Dito sa kabilang ito, katabi ng more, meron ditong points. So, for that question, bibigyan natin ng 5 points. So, 5. Yan. Kita na? O, oh, gawin lang natin. Dito kasi may number. Ang bawa. Ayan. Uh, 2 points. Yan. And then, since tapos na tayo dito, 
pwede na natin siyang i-preview. Or kung gusto pa natin mag-add ng new question, click lang natin itong nasa baba, next, new question. Kapag okay na, click natin okay. So this time, tingnan natin yung ginawa nating question. So i-preview natin. Ayan na. Earth is the only livable planet in the solar system. So ito na yun kasi nilagyan natin ng sound. Pwede rin natin siyang i-click yung image, mag-zoom in siya, mag-zoom out din. Tapos sasagot na tayo. For example, true. Tapos submit. Great job! Okay, so ganyan lang. And then, X na natin. Proceed na tayo sa next type of quiz. Click lang natin tong okay. Multiple choice na tayo. New question. Dito try naman natin ah uh, kumopya doon sa Word uh, sa Microsoft Word natin. Kung meron tayong prepared. Saglit lang ha, pause ko muna to kasi hindi pala ako nakapagano open. So, this time, kukuha naman tayo ng question natin from our Microsoft Word. So, pwede natin i-copy-paste yung question. Subukan natin na. Yan. So, bawa ito yung question natin. Copy. And then, paste natin dun sa app. Yan. So, what planet is known as the red planet? So, ito yung choices natin. For example, Mars... Jupiter, Earth, Mercury. So, ayan. So, what is the correct answer? Yung Mars. So, ito ang lalagyan natin ng mark. Lakihan natin ulit para mas kita. Bagal, sandali lang. Ayan, so, ganun pa rin yung procedure. Kung gusto mong lalagyan ng uh, image, click mo lang to. Pag lalagyan mo ng sound, click mo to. And then, dito naman, so, hindi na natin papalitan, lalakihan na lang natin. Nasa iyo yan, pag gusto mong palitan o oh, hindi. And then, click mo ulit yung, o oh, ito, 10 for this question. Halimbawa, bigyan natin ng 10 points. Oh. Kung gagawa ka pa ng another question, dito mo lang, new question. And then, Click mo na ang OK. So, sa multiple response, ganun din ang gagawin natin. Same lang procedure ng ginawa natin sa true or false, multiple choice. Pero dito sa multiple response, yung uh, pwedeng marami kang sagot. Fill in the blank, same lang lahat yung procedure. Makikita naman natin doon. May mga commands naman, susundan lang natin. So, meron ako ditong, uh, pagka natapos na yan, pwede na natin siyang i-publish. Click lang natin yung publish. For example, gawin natin to no? Publish natin. And then, may mga icons na lalabas. Uh, publish on Quiz Creator Online. Uh, publish to my computer, web, LMS, CD, uh, CD slash EXE, or CD slash EXE, tapos Word slash Excel. So, dito natin siya ngayon isi-save sa o i-publish sa CD slash Excel. So, click natin yan. And then, palitan halimbawa natin to ng science quiz. Science quiz. And then, save natin dito sa location. Halimbawa, saan mo gustong ilalagay? Doon natin ilalagay sa desktop. So, desktop lang. And then, Click mo lang yung OK. Palitan natin kasi meron na akong file name na Science Quiz. 
So, baguhin muna natin to. Palitan natin to ng science lang. Yan. And then, publish na natin. Yan lang. Wait lang natin. Makapublish. Tapos, ayan na. Pwede na natin i-view ang quiz. So, titingnan natin ha. Meron kasi ako ditong prepared na lahat ng type ng quiz meron na. So, X muna natin yan. So, itong gagamitin natin. So, ito. So, ayan. Ito na yung quiz. Sanibawa, uh, Earth is the only livable planet in the solar system. So, pwede natin i-click yung picture para mag-zoom in at saka zoom out. So, ito, sagutan na natin. Click natin, true. And then, submit. Great job! Oh, okay. Next naman, what planet is known as red planet? So, ito. Click lang natin yung sagot and then submit. Okay, next question. Ito naman yung sa multiple response na sinasabi ko. Which of the following are planets? So, pipindutin lang natin yung mga planets. Earth and Venus. Yan. Submit. Okay. And then, blank is the largest planet in the solar system. Type natin dyan yung sagot natin. Jupiter. Yan. Submit. Correct. Ito naman yung sa matching type. Match column A to B by dragging the animals to its group. Halimbawa, ito. Mammal, elephant, um, amphibian, frog, reptile, snake, bird, eagle. Ayan. And then, submit. Correct. Ayan. Arrange ito naman yung sa sequence. Arrange the correct sequence of the life cycle of a frog. So, ano ba ang umpisa niyan? Itadrag mo lang din. Egg. Sunod. Tadpole. Ayan. Nakaayos na siya. And then, submit mo lang. Okay. So, lalabas na ngayon yung score mo. So, total questions natin is 6. Ang naging score natin is 50. Full score din 50. So, perfect tayo. Passing rate natin is 80%. Passing score is 40. Ngayon, kung gusto mong i-review yung sinagutan natin, Earth click mo lang like yung only planet in the solar system. Ay, Great ay, sorry, job! Sorry. sorry, yan. Titingnan natin yung outline. So, ayan na yung mga question list. Nandyan yung ating mga questions. So, tama tayo lahat. So, ganyan lang po. So, ganyan kung paano magpa-function yung ating uh, Wonder Quiz, uh, Wonder Share Quiz Creator. So, yun lang po. Thank you so much sa panunood. And of course, thank you so much DepEd, EdTech Unit for giving us the opportunity to learn this basic program. Mabuhay kayong lahat. God bless us all. Stay safe.